Alright people, I'm going to show you how to make some empanadas. Please try this at home, it's a really really fun um, dish to make, some really funky crispy delicacy from, from Latin America. So the first step, we, we're going to cook some potatoes. So literally just grab, you know, three or four potatoes. You know, you put them in a, in a pot with some water. Bring them, bring, them, um, bring them to the boil until they're really nice and soft. Give them a, a very, very um, gentle mash. You don't want to over puree them. You still want a little bit of texture, 500 grams of minced beef and I'm gonna put it in a pot. I'm going to add some water, about three or four cups, as you can see, sort of swimming in water. I'm just gonna season it with just a little pinch of cumin and a good pinch of salt and a tiny, tiny little bit of garlic, so. So it's just flavoring the water, basically. And the idea of this water is to, you know, with your hand, just break up the mince so everything's sort of falling apart. And then just gonna bring this to the boil. Bring it to the boil. As soon as it comes to the boil, turn it off. We like to use some um, spring onion rather than brown onion, which we feel we feel like it's more aromatic and uh, and it's easier to to blend. So I'm gonna heat up some oil. Just a you know square of oil. And then we're gonna put spring onion and a tablespoon of garlic and a tablespoon of cumin and a bit of seasoning. So we're going to add our seasoned spring onion, cumin, garlic and salt onto our mixture. Our filling is done for the empanadas. Now we're going to get into the making of our corn dough. You can buy this flour uh, from a lot of uh, places. You can order it through us. Um, it's only like $6 a packet uh, and you can make lots and lots of empanadas. Half a packet, uh, which will make you a quick 30 empanadas. So we'll do half a packet in there. I'm gonna add a little bit of color. All right, I'm gonna do a little tablespoon of salt. And then we're gonna add some nice fresh water to the mix. And I'm just gonna add a little bit at a time and we're gonna fold it. Just squeeze it with your hand until you find that really nice texture. Um, you can see that it's coming off my hands, so before it was really sticky, now it's sort of more firm. I can make a bowl and nothing will stick to my hands. So that's how you know roughly when the dough is ready. So this is a typical tortillera. Now if you don't have a tortillera, you can use two small plates or a small chopping board and um, that can be used as well. Squash nice and firm. You know, you can make them bigger, smaller, however you feel. And then you can fill it up. And then you fold it like this. Like that. Close it up. Then you can grab a little cookie cutter or something sharp to give it a nice shape. And then just squeeze it with your finger so you can close it. Put it in the fryer. The, front, the oil should be nice and hot so it bubbles away until it turns a little bit golden. And our empanadas are ready to eat. We serve them with some of this beautiful hot salsa. And um, you know, if you can't be bothered making them at home, I'm happy to make them for you. So, buen provecho. <laughs>